Hi guys, welcome to my channel. Today I want to show you one of my little codes. So I need to stop Cosmo first because he's going to move around, make some noise. Be impatient like he's doing right now. I know my friend you want to play, but you're going to knock down the whole thing. So I'm going to stop you now before you destroy my tower. Well, sorry buddy, but I want to show something to my viewers. So the last uh, few updates from uh, Enki or Anki were great. Let's have a look at them very briefly here because there was one, not a problem, but one thing that I found a little disappointing. Like, again, don't, don't get me wrong, the codes are amazing. But if you look at Hot Potato, and I did a video for some of those uh, games, but not all of them. If you look at Hot Potato, Cosmo does not move cubes around. The same with Orchestra. The same with Light Show. In Mag uh, Magic Fortune Teller, I did a video of that. You shake Cosmo, he's not touching cubes. The same with uh, Fire Truck. Laser Smile, it's a display on his face. The same with Cosmogram, display, mini golf, display. Shake it. Hugh the Human moved the cubes, not Cosmo. Remote Control Racer, again, uh, only Cosmo racing. Complement Generator on his face. Uh, you, potato, the, uh, the gold, but not potato. Potato Gold Detector, you uh, also control Cosmo. Driving in circles, um, again, no interaction with a cube. Uh, it's just like he's going around a cube. And pedal a Ball on his display. So, there is already in the games and tricks a couple of things that Cosmo can do with the cubes. For example, he can build a pyramid. He can stack cubes, but that's all he can do. So, I wrote here, and I'm going to show you first the uh, limitation that Cosmo has. I, wa I wanted to build a, a three-cube tower like you see at the moment. But the limitation is that I'm going to run a program here to move his lift so I can explain to you what's going on here. So with his lift up, we can put the cube on and obviously he's going to hold it correctly. But if I put two, he's going to tilt, but he's going to fall forward. So I'm going to demonstrate that again. If I put two, he's going to fall. So it's kind of not possible to build a tower of three cubes, except if you play with what we just saw. So I'm going to go here to my code, project number 15, no sorry, nine. Project nine, very simple code you will see, it's like 10 or 12 lines, here you go here. So animation, and Cosmo will need to duck with cube number one, that's important, he needs to see cube number one. And then, look at all these numbers here. It took me, like really, it took me half a day to fine tune all these numbers to make sure that this would work, believe it or not. So all we have to do now is have Cosmo C cube number one. We need to stack two or three, whatever. And then you will see what's going to happen. I'm going to move my camera here. Cosmo is going to move forward. Same with this camera here. I'm going to move it a bit like so, so we can see what's going to happen. There you go. Now I'm going to hit the start flag. So there you go guys, I may, be, I may be the first and the only one in the world to be able to build a tower of three cubes with Cosmo. And this is why I call this video the Pisa Tower in Italy, because at some point the tower was inclined just like the real thing. So guys, very simple code, again like about maybe like 10 or 12, I didn't count, or 12 lines. So I hope you appreciated the very, this uh, short video 
and uh, I wish you a great day.